This is West Hills Wednesdays, Marshall County's number one source for student news. What's poppin' people? It's West Hills Wednesdays and I'm Abby. And I'm Jillian. We have a busy show for you today. West Hills teachers recently won Teacher of the Year, Miss Sari Perry and Jill Grenier. They were also recent guests on T Tiger Talk. Let's watch that brief episode. Welcome to Tiger Talk. I'm Caroline. And I'm Caroline. Today we are here with West Hills' Teachers of the Year, Miss Jill Greenier and Miss Sarah Perry. Welcome to our show today. Thank you. Good morning. Which college should you attend? I attended the College of New Jersey in Trenton, New Jersey. I attended Austin Peay State University in Clarksville, Tennessee, Grand Canyon University, and Lipscomb in Nashville. What inspired you to pursue this career path? I definitely think um, helping children has been something I've always wanted to do, um, so it's just evolved from there. My second grade teacher, Mrs. Vivian, was wonderful, um, and she took an interest in everything that I did, and my goal in life was to be like Mrs. Vivian. What is your favorite part of your job? Um, the favorite part of my job, I would have to say, is helping students who struggle and who have difficulty in the classroom and watching them grow and get back out to class and be successful. I love when students can find a book that they just cannot stop reading and get super excited about. What is the biggest challenge you face with this job? Um, the hardest part of the job for me, I would say, is um, when students graduate from my program and go back to class, it's sometimes difficult for me to let them go just because I've become so attached to them, but it's also wonderful to see them successful and doing well. I just think there's not enough time in the day to do everything that I want to do. What about this job inspires you to show up here every day? I think my students. I don't, I mean, just coming in and working with the students every day. And I think um, just being at this school, West Hills has the most amazing supported, supportive and loving environment um, ever. And it's such a joy to get to come into work every day here. That's it for Tiger Talk today. Thank you for joining us. I'm Thank Caroline. You. Thank and you. And I'm Caroline. Bye. Last night, some of our West Hills students and their families enjoyed another paint night. WTN was there and Sasha got some great footage. Here it is.
Late last week, West Hills held its annual Winter Wonderland pageant. Carly Lord got to interview some people there. We're here tonight with our fourth grade winner. What's your name? Rain. Rain, how does it feel to win? Um, it feels good. Did you expect to win? No. We're here with our first runner-up. Name? Madeline. What were you most nervous about? Not being good enough for everyone. <laughs> Thank you. We're here with our second runner-up for fourth grade. What's your name? Ellie. Ellie, what inspired you to do the pageant? My mom. <laughs> Great job, Ellie. We're here with our third runner-up for fourth grade. What's your name? Kamaya Malone. Kamaya, how did you feel about the pageant? Yeah, I, f I felt happy, excited, and scared. <laughs> Thank you. We're here with our first place for fifth grade. Name? Kenzie. How does it feel to win, Kenzie? Um, it feels great because it's my first pageant, and I've never done one before, so, yeah. Did you expect to win? No. Thank you, Kenzie. You did great. We're here with our fifth grade's first runner-up. Name? Noli. Noli, who inspired you to do this? Well, I really don't know but second last year I got second place and this year I got first. Thank you. You look very beautiful. We're here with second runner up for fifth grade. Name? Jayla Ewing. What inspired you to do this pageant? Um I did it last year and I wanted to try and get first place because I got second place last year. Thank you. You did really well. We're here with our third runner up. For fifth grade, name? Olivia Bryant. Olivia, how do you feel about the pageant? It's very fun and I love doing it with all my friends. Thank you, Olivia. We're here with our first place for sixth grade. Name? Emma Cuevas. Emma, how did you feel about winning? I felt pretty nervous at first, but like once I was backstage waiting, I got more confidence in winning, but then I was like, you know, can't have the, I can't have the chances. Like sometimes, you just gotta join these because you got nothing else to do. Were you surprised when you won? Yes, like really surprised. Good luck out there, Emma. We're here with our first runner-up. Name? Olympia Kathy. Olympia, what can you take from this pageant? Well, I can improve on my next pageants, and I can just be grateful for my parents and family for supporting me. Thank you, Olympia, and good luck out there. We're here with our second runner-up for sixth grade. Name? Maddie Wise. Who inspired you to do this pageant? My aunt. Thank you, Maddie. We're here with our third runner-up for sixth grade. Name? Bradley Warren. What inspired you to do the pageant? I just I had nothing else to do, so I just want to have something fun to do, so I did it because I also got to see my friends. Thank you. We're here with our Viewer's Choice winner of the night. Name? Lily Ann. How does it feel to get Viewer's Choice? Um, I don't know. It, I just got, like, surprised or something. Thank you. I don't think we're going to have snow at all this year. Well, one thing I do know, we're going to have a lot of rain. Here's West Hills weather. West Hills weather is brought to you by McDonald's. I'm loving it. Hi, West Hills. I'm Josh, and this is the weather. The weather is going to be more of the same. Temperatures up and down with rain almost every day. This time next week, it will be into the 70s. Spring is on its way. Or it could snow next week. Who really knows anymore? This has been Josh. Back to you, girls. That's it for us, Stills Wednesdays. I'm Abby. And I'm Jillian. Before we go, Mr. Wood has entered the chat. <laughs> uh, thanks, girls. We're here at WTN have, been, have a lot of moving parts. One of those moving parts left West Hills to go to bigger and better things. Miss Patty always helped us check mistakes and suggestions about WTN programming. So in honor of Miss Patty, today we dedicate this show to her. Please come back and visit us. Okay, boomer. Okay, boomer. I'm a Gen Xer. <laughs> We should plan that out more. No. 
Can we do it again? No, we're not doing it again. What? Are no, because we we're on right now. Are we done? And you're fired. People, it's West Coast Wednesdays, and I'm Abby. And I'm Joy. We have a busy show for you today. You see anything? No. My the year before that. What's up, people? It's West Coast Wednesdays, and I'm Abby. And I'm Joy. We have a busy show for you today. Okay. I can't see that. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> see how we struggle. <laughs> okay. Okay. Uh, okay, boomer. Okay, boomer. I'm a Gen Xer. 